Hi, it's Therese from Lost in Paper and I'm here for Scrapbook Boutique and going to be playing with some Mama Elephant stamps. This set's called Mum, Lovely Mums and I'm going to be doing some watercolouring today and using my Kiritaki Ganzo Tambi watercolours and I'm having heaps of fun with them. So this is kind of a no line technique because I'm not using black ink, I'm going to be using coloured ink and this is the Ranger Archival ink which is good for watercolouring it won't run and the two colours I've got today are tea rose and olive and these are really really pretty colours. The olive was going to be a little bit dark so I'm just stamping it off before I stamp that out and I'm using a leaf from the Modern Blooms My Favourite Things set. So I'm working on some watercolour cardstock and I'm adding some clean water to my flower petals first and then I'm going to be working on the petals kind of one at a time even, even though they're all the same colour I want them to look separate so I'm just trying to let the water do the work and basically I'm still learning my paints here I haven't had these paints for very for very long and I'm really enjoying them so I'm letting you watch my learning process I suppose so this is um, a red colour which is almost more of a coral colour which is one of my favourite crafting colours to use and I'm working on separate petals that aren't near each other so that will allow some time to dry and then if I do touch other areas that are still wet it won't bleed too much. Not that it's really going to matter here because they are all the same colour anyway. So I'll list all the colours that I use from the Gansai paints on my blog and the link will be in the YouTube description below and I'll leave you with some colouring and I'll be back when all of that is done.
I'm back now and the sentiment I've got is from the Everyday Greetings set which is also Mama Elephant and I'm using some Onyx Black ink because I find that really works well on the watercolour cardstock although I am stamping on the smooth side and then I'm going to attach this to the front of my top fold card just using some stamp runner tape and then add one last little detail which is some stickles glitter glue and this one's called cool mint which is just so pretty so thanks for joining me today i've had heaps of fun i'll be back again real soon till next time happy paper crafting bye